Hello guys, we are back once again. I want to spend a few minutes now talking to you about how we might find the slope of a line from the standard form equation. Okay, remember uh, an example of standard form would have been something like, uh, let's say 5x minus 3y equals uh, 12. 5x minus 3y equals 12. This is standard form AX plus BY equals C. Uh, the slope of this line. Trying to find the slope of the line without actually having to graph it. So what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to convert the standard form to slope intercept form. Okay, we're going to convert this standard form to slope intercept form um, by algebraically by algebraically isolating Y by algebraically isolating Y. Okay, so we want to isolate this Y in this particular equation. All right, now to do that, let's just take a quick run at what we're going to do to make that happen. To isolate this Y, I think the first thing I would do is I'd transpose the 5X. And so I would have negative 3Y equals negative 5X negative 5x and uh, plus 12. Okay, so I simply took the 5x from the left side of the equals, put it on the right side of the equals, and put it, uh, uh, put it over here as a negative. Okay, now that gets me closer to isolating y. There's only one more thing I need to do to isolate y here. So I will divide this by negative 3. And then I'll come through and I'll divide each part of the uh, of this equation by negative 3. So now when I divide by negative 3 across the board here what I'll end up with is y, see my negative 3's cancel out, equals, now negative divide negative is positive so these negatives cancel out, y equals 5 thirds x and then positive 12 divided by negative 3 is negative 4. Okay, so we've taken this equation and through the algebraic process have converted into this format. Now remember this format is slope intercept format. Now from this format, from this form, slope intercept form, we can easily know that the slope of this line is 5 thirds. The slope of the line is 5 thirds. The y-intercept is 0 comma negative 4. Okay, so slope, y-intercept. From there we could draw the line easily. And so let me let that be it for this particular lesson simply converting uh, converting standard form of the equation of a line into slope intercept form and that way we'll know the slope and the y-intercept of that line very easily. Okay, I'll see you on the next video.